Volkswagen is scrambling to fix its mistakes from the past, making sudden changes like rushing back to physical buttons, redesigning their cabins and preparing cheaper electric vehicles such as the ID series with zonal electrical architecture to reduce wiring and make constant upgrades possible. They are desperate to win back the attention of the masses. But while Volkswagen is still learning from their failures, Tesla has already been moving on the right path for years, and the Tesla Model 2 is the clearest proof of that. And now, that Model 2 is finally revealed. The very first look is nothing short of insane. This is a car created with a basic yet premium interior design that older drivers can actually trust, use easily and even feel proud of. It is simple without being boring, smart without being intimidating and premium without being overly complicated. The Model 2 completely redefines what an entry-level electric car can be and forces every single rival, including Volkswagen, to copy it. And in this video we are going to show you exactly how Tesla pulled it off. So before we dive deep, tap that subscribe button and ring the bell right now if you want to join more than 2,000 future insiders here at Torque Element who are watching the iPhone moment of the electric vehicle world unfold. Now the first big question everyone has is this. How can Tesla's Model 2 deliver a basic but premium interior that instantly makes anyone feel right at home? Let's be honest, those spaceship-style interiors with endless screens and odd designs might look futuristic, but they scare away almost half of the population. Tesla's Model 2 is rumored to focus instead on a basic yet premium interior that speaks comfort, familiarity, and trust. Why settle for confusing tech that feels like it belongs in a science lab? when the Model 2 could give you a cabin that feels intuitive from day one. Especially for people in their golden years, every detail matters more than ever. And here's where Tesla cracked the code that has left automakers confused for decades. The Model 2's basic but premium idea is not about making things too simple or cheap. It's about making sophistication feel effortless and natural. Think about your favorite coffee shop. You know exactly where the sugar is, the barista remembers your order, and you feel completely relaxed and at home. That's exactly the feeling Tesla wants to build into the Model 2. And the numbers show this is not just marketing talk. The design philosophy focuses on familiar layouts, clear zones for controls and storage, and roughly 20% more accessible spots than what current Tesla models offer. This is a direct answer to Volkswagen's past confusion-filled interiors that left about 35% of users over the age of 50 frustrated. Tesla carefully watched Volkswagen's mistakes and realized premium does not equal complicated. Premium means thoughtfully designed for real human beings. The optimizations for seniors are where things get revolutionary. Imagine door sills placed just 14 inches high for easy entry, which ergonomic studies prove reduces strain by 25% compared to standard heights. Adjustable seats offer a wide 10-inch range with built-in grip handles, accommodating nearly 90% of adult heights while specifically helping those with arthritis. That is vital because official health data shows nearly 30% of seniors face mobility issues, and Tesla is designing for real American demographics, not just tech-savvy engineers in Silicon Valley. Tesla's mastery in material choices makes the Model 2 even more impressive. Soft-touch armrests, neatly stitched seats, and subtle metallic accents combine to create a premium feeling without a premium cost. The durable synthetic materials Tesla uses resist wear about 60% better than traditional fabrics, according to accelerated aging tests. On top of that, easy clean surfaces are a blessing for the 75% of seniors who say they dislike high-maintenance vehicles. This is not about cutting corners. It is about engineering materials that actually improve with age. The visuals are just as carefully thought out. Displays use large 1.5-inch fonts with 95% contrast ratios making every piece of information clear even in tough lighting conditions. A special senior mode features oversized icons and voice guidance slowed down by 15% to match the needs of older drivers who face natural vision decline, something that affects nearly 40% of people over 65. Studies show this is not just acknowledgement of aging, but rather solutions that make technology supportive instead of intimidating. The lighting and ambient strategy takes things even further. Tesla uses warm LED lights calibrated at 3000 Kelvin, the ideal temperature for eye comfort. Door edge lighting helps prevent nighttime accidents, with safety models suggesting a possible 20% reduction in falls. The result is a premium environment that feels safe and welcoming without adding unnecessary complexity. 
Compare that to Volkswagen's recent shift after facing backlash from a quarter of their customers who found their sterile interiors unwelcoming. If Tesla gets this approach right, the Model 2 could achieve customer satisfaction levels as high as 90%, creating genuine cross-generational appeal that no electric vehicle has ever managed before. Imagine sliding into a seat that feels soft, supportive, and as familiar as an old friend. This is not just design, it's emotional engineering. Picture your grandmother stepping into the driver's seat, smiling because everything feels right where it should be. Every surface feels welcoming and every detail whispers, this was made for you. That is how Tesla turns simple engineering into a heartfelt experience. Now let me ask you directly, do you like cutting-edge technology even if it takes time to learn, or do you prefer familiar designs that work perfectly from the first moment? Drop a 1 in the comments if you are team cutting-edge or a two if you are team familiar and intuitive. Your answers will reveal something even the industry experts are missing about Tesla's target audience. And speaking of familiarity, Tesla has one more surprise up its sleeve. Because while other automakers are either going all in on touchscreens or rushing back to random physical buttons, Tesla has found the perfect balance. A hybrid control system that makes physical buttons smarter than ever before. This brings us to the second big question. How did Tesla reinvent controls with physical buttons in the Model 2? How do you honestly feel when your car's entire dashboard is one giant touchscreen? Sure, it might look sleek, but when you're driving, especially in urgent moments, you want quick and reliable access. Tesla's Model 2 brings back physical buttons in a game-changing way that restores sanity to the driving experience. Instead of making drivers fumble through menus, Tesla introduces oversized 1.2 to 2-inch buttons designed for climate, lighting, and volume. These are not cheap plastic buttons. They feature textures for grip even with gloves or wet hands, and 100% backlighting so they're visible even in total darkness. Grouped into four or five simple clusters, every control sits within six inches of the steering wheel, the optimal distance for safety according to ergonomic studies. This is where Tesla outshines Volkswagen once again. Remember how Volkswagen's haptic touch systems lagged so badly that nearly half of senior drivers complained? Tesla studied those failures and instead built a hybrid approach. Advanced software handles the complex functions, while physical controls manage the essential life-saving ones like hazard lights, with activation times under one second. Tesla even added redundancy. Physical override systems work offline, cutting electronic failure risks by around 35% based on Tesla's fleet data. This matters because more than half of seniors worry about system crashes leaving them stranded. Tesla removed that fear by making sure backup systems always work. The smartest part is how Tesla blends customization with safety. Core emergency functions are fixed and unchangeable, while secondary controls can be personalized through software. This satisfies both the 70% of drivers who like defaults and the tech-savvy minority who want customization. Now here's the kicker. Tesla's added physical buttons cost only about $75 per car, yet studies show they increase customer satisfaction by 30%. That small cost delivers a huge win. Contrast that with Volkswagen's painful loss of 20% of their customer base after touchscreen frustrations. For senior drivers especially, Tesla's hybrid button system could reduce accident rates by 15%, since it eliminates dangerous menu diving during emergencies. Imagine driving in heavy rain and needing your wipers instantly. Instead of scrolling through menus, your fingers instinctively find a button in less than a second. That is not just convenience, it is safety and confidence built into every drive. And here's a question for you. Do you think Tesla's hybrid approach of smart software plus physical buttons will become the new industry standard? Or will other car makers stubbornly stick to their all-touch obsession and lose millions of customers? If you believe Tesla's button strategy will force Ford, GM, BMW, and others to copy it within the next two years, type Tesla wins in the comments right now. But we are not done. Because Tesla is not only fixing controls. They are building an entire ecosystem strategy with the Model 2 that could flip the affordable electric vehicle market upside down. The third big question is this. How can Tesla Model 2 set trends in the affordable EV space and force competitors to copy? The answer is simple. Tesla did not just design another cheap EV. They created a blueprint where affordability and innovation exist together, and now competitors have no choice but to follow. Imagine automatic emergency braking as a standard feature, 
cutting crash risks by 45%. Imagine over-the-air upgrades offered clearly and affordably, around $15 per month for premium features, unlike Volkswagen's hidden fees that raised costs by nearly 20%. Add Tesla's ecosystem advantage. Superchargers reduce charging costs by 30%, and regular software updates improve efficiency by 12% year after year, saving the average American driver roughly $400 annually. For seniors, the advantages grow even bigger. Model 2 could lower insurance premiums by 25% through proven safety scores. It could offer home servicing for the 40% of seniors with mobility challenges, plus 24-7 live voice support that already resolves 85% of common problems. That is not just an ecosystem, it is a safety net. Pair all this with projections that say EV adoption in America will reach 40% by 2028, and Tesla could grab a quarter of the affordable EV market with the Model 2 alone. If Volkswagen and others refuse to copy, they risk losing 15% or more of their market share. The shock here is this, the Model 2 is not the cheapest EV. It is the best value EV. It keeps ownership costs under $4,000 a year, a figure retirees on a fixed income of about $50,000 find irresistible. That kind of affordability alone could push adoption up by 20%. Tesla is not just competing. Tesla is rewriting the rules. And when other automakers finally try to copy this playbook, remember who did it first. So let me leave you with this. Do you believe the Model 2 will truly set the trends every automaker must follow? Or can others still catch up in time? Drop, insane first look, in the comments if you are ready to see Tesla dominate this new era. Because make no mistake, this is only the beginning. And here at Torque Element, with our growing family of more than 2,000 subscribers, we will keep showing you every step of this electric revolution. So stay curious, stay excited, and I'll catch you in the next one.